father says that you have been my friend. You came back for me. Why would you do this? Because the needs of the one outweigh the needs of the many. Help me, Jim. Take me home. Bones, we are. We are home. Then perhaps it's not too late. The Enterprise is 20 years old. We'd hope to take her back to Genesis. In your absence, Genesis has become a galactic controversy. Until the Federation Council makes policy, you are all under orders not to discuss with anyone your knowledge of Genesis. May I ask why? Consider it a quarantine planet and a forbidden subject. I've come a long way for the power of Genesis. And what do I find? A weakling human, a molten boy, and a woman. The Genesis wave. His cells could have been regenerated. The most powerful destructive force ever created. Surrender your vessel. I give two minutes for you and your gallant crew. I'm sorry, I'm late. Spare me your human platitudes, Kirk. Why did you leave him on Genesis? Spock trusted you. You denied him his future. Of all the souls I have encountered, this was the most human. He entrusted you with his very essence, with everything that was not of the body. He asked you to bring him to us. Kirk, if you do this, you'll never sit in the captain's chair again. Warp speed. Emergency power! If we don't help each other, we'll die here! Perfect! Then that's the way it shall be! He would have found a way if there was that much at stake. Spock would have found a way. Yes. But how? Remember. I have been, and ever shall be, your friend.